All right, today is Wednesday. Uh, it's been absolutely the long, one of the longest days I've had in a long time. Um, as most of you know, um, people are getting their uh, booster shots now, and I got mine. And oh my gosh, I was out like a light. I mean, not out, because a lot of people said that that you know their uh, last shot was like get, getting the flu for a day or two. Man, I just, everything ached and I just have eaten very little all day. The mail came in a long time ago. When I say a long time ago, as it came in like, oh, I don't know, three and a half hours, four hours ago, five hours ago. But I will show you some of the stuff that came in. And, um, and if you haven't seen my previous video, which was my postage stamps video, um, if you remember some of my videos from the way old days, I would go to the um, Salem Coin and Stamp and get these things, sometimes in the 50% off bin. Um, because maybe there might be a corner missing or it was ripped in half but you could still use a stamp and you know stick it on an envelope and that sort of thing and man I did use a ton for my TTMs and it was really fun to seeing what kind of stamp combos I could make and I got four postcards in with my famous stamp combos so one has a 33 and one has a 13 this is a Roadrunner postcard so if you ever wanted to know what a Roadrunner looks like that's a Roadrunner uh, very unusual bird there and then um, this is from Amboy, and I believe uh, Amboy is a place that was listed as closed on my list. And um, I believe it's Amboy, and it was listed as closed on my list. And I went and checked the website, and there was Amboy was listed as open. It's a tiny little post office, I think on the on. It might be off of Route 66, don't quote me on that, but famous YouTuber Adam the Woo actually just visited the Amboy Post Office, but they were closed. But anyway, it's really cool to get that one. I thought that was really pretty neat. I did my own research and found the data was wrong. And maybe they reopened the post office in the last four years uh, because they needed it. I, don't, I really don't know. The next one is a Christmas postcard. That's really not as Christmas card as much as it is, you know, a piece of stationery, but it was printed like a postcard. So, Happy Holidays is what it says on the back of it. And this is from, um, I, oh, I can't read it. Uh, Goodwin? Godwin? No, Dobbins. I'm sorry. Dobbins Post Office. You won't be able to read the cancels because this camera isn't that great. I'd love to get to use my other camera, but it doesn't offload. Very, it could take me half the afternoon to, and I would love to do that, use that camera and voiceover. And that's what I used to do, but uh, not, not anymore. So there's that one, and maybe I have another camera that I could get the, um, if I would just get a new, uh, I don't know, I'm missing something for it, um, and it's a pretty good one. This one here is from, oh, I, I, oh, uh, something park, oh, oh, something Lake Clear Lake Park, I think is what it is. It's kind of a faint cancel there, but it's got some 70s stamps, and they're in the nice 1980s, I think this is from 1988. This 22, and then these are from the early 70s, and this is from around 1975 or 76, somewhere in that range there. And this is a uh, flag postcard, and I said, well, have you ever heard of Christmas in July? Um, well, I've, have, but have you ever heard of July and Christmas? So that's why I sent that one. I just thought, you know, that's being kind of funny, ha ha ho ho. This one I found at the bins, which is most of the, I think almost all those, yeah, every single one of those postcards I found at the bins for like a cent or two. Some sort of, you know, kind of angel-themed postcard. I thought it was appropriate for this time of year. And this is from uh, Crow's Landing. So, uh, unusual name there, Crow's Landing. There are some post offices that probably do get a lot of mail um, for their unusual names, because I am not the only postmark collector out there, but just really hard finding videos for them. Uh, they probably post on Instagram or somewhere else, but, um, and this has a bunch of Christmas stamps on there. You can see the Christmas ones. A couple of, uh, I had a block of four of these, but it was falling apart, and I said, you know what, eh, use them. And then, of course, my famous one-cent stamps I picked up at the stamp show. So, hope you enjoyed that. Happy holidays to everybody if I don't post any further videos. I have family coming in the next day or two, and thank you for watching. Bymart members, we have the last minute gifts and supplies you need. Like Plus Mart gift wrap, 75 or 100 square foot rolls, now just $169. Get the shop vac 5 gallon wet or dry vacuum, Bymart sale price just $33.97. And protect your family with the Jameson Code 1 smoke alarm. Bymart sale priced at $16.97, after rebate only $9.97. Shop during Bymart's extended hours now, but hurry, this sale ends Christmas Eve at Bymart. Happy holidays from Bymart.